Carter Pallone was only two years old when he was diagnosed with an aggressive form of brain cancer. He is undergoing expensive chemotherapy at Helen DeVos Children's Hospital. His family says the financial support they've received from the community has been incredible. And today, a big surprise from strangers added to that. 24 Hour News 8's Justin Kolar was there for today's moment. I don't know any of them. We don't know any of them. They just came and started this event for us. And so it's pretty nice because, like, it's just nice to have people that you don't know and do things for you. Dozens of bikers rolled into the driveway of Helen DeVos Children's Hospital Saturday, turning this would-be parking lot into a motorcycle club. If you look behind me, you'll see all these bikes. We're all bikers. These riders here today to help lighten the load for one family by offering money and something as simple as a smile. Take a look. I mean, take a look at the child. It makes it all worth it right there. I mean, everything we do is for the children. You know, and to see their faces light up and the surprise in their eyes and everything, it just, it makes it worth it right there. William's only child, Carter, was diagnosed with stage four metastatic pineoblastoma. Like the first week that he was like in the hospital, I literally woke up every day crying because I couldn't deal with it. I didn't want to believe it. It was hard. Right. I never in a million years would have expected this to happen to him at all. The riding club Rockets and Baggers raised over $900 today for Carter and his family. More than the money though, this riding club offers his family support in their time of need by even making Carter a junior member. I'm a cancer survivor. I just got over cancer myself. I would love to see Carter in a vest riding on his own someday. And while it may be a little too early to see Carter riding one of these hogs, he's finally crawling again. And mom says that's a start. He seems to be doing a lot better. I'm so grateful for everything people have done for us. And it's, it's just nice to know that there's good people out there to do that for us, for anybody, really. In Grand Rapids, Justin Kolar, 24-Hour News 8.